हेलो फ्रेंड्स टुडे आई विल टेल यू प्रोसीजर ऑफ टेस्टिंग स्टेयरिंग गेयर एंड सम सोलास रिक्वायरमेंट ऑफ स्टेयरिंग गेयर सो वॉज दिस वीडियो कम्प्लीटली आई हैव पोस्टेड सो मेनी टॉपिक्स फॉर योर नॉलेज लाइक ब्रिज इक्विपमेंट एक डिस लिंक इज गिवेन इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन एंड यू कैन वॉच सो लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो सो गाइज दिस इज द स्टेयरिंग गेयर एंड स्टेयरिंग गेयर टेस्ट मस्ट बी कैरीड आउट 12 to 2 hour prior every arrival or departure so your company checklist must be followed that procedure should be given in there so first confirm the radar is clear once radar is clear proceed number 2 step once radar is clear confirm primary and secondary communication from the steering gear must be working condition and after that run the steering pump one by one first test from pump one after that from pump two and from both pump when you are testing radar movement from 35 degree one side to 30 degree one side is not more than 28 second using power units as per your vessel design so you have to note down from the pump 1 how many second it takes from number 2 pump how many second it takes and and the last from both pumps once you have tried out hand steering then you have to try it out and a few and as you can see we have to rotate this lever at and a few mode like this and after that you have to check emergency power supply for the main steering gear so as on my vessel number 2 supplied by emergency power so you have to check uh, check all radar angle indicator displaying actual radar position and illumination you have to check on bridge beam also that all the radar angle indicator are displaying actually if required synchronize gyro repeater in steering compartment so in some other video i will show you how to synchronize gyro repeaters guys these are the basic things to be checked for steering gear testing and if you are entering in us water any any addition of that you have to check also emergency steering gear drill carried out in last 3 month if not conduct drill within 40 hours prior arrival us water this is the requirement of us water and uh, second thing test steering gear control power failure alarm these are the us water requirement so alarms you can test from here uh, this is the alarm panel uh, this is the steering gear alarm panel and uh, you have to acknowledge if someone is testing from steering gear so as you can see here the acknowledge button is given and you have to test only this from this button so everything is working fine this indicates control for event or your negro this testing uh, like steering gear control system power failure or steering gear power unit failure and automatic isolation arrangement and other automatic equipment are requirement of us water if you are not entering in us water then you are exempted to carry out these tests so guys uh, this is the complete video of steering gear testing procedure and in another video i will post uh, how to carry out the pre arrival and pre departure checks and one one more thing i forgot to tell you already i have uh, so i have made a video that how to test the of course alarm of steering gear link is given in the description you can go through thank you so much guys to watch my video keep supporting me 
सब्सक्राइब माई चैनल एंड हिट द लाइक बटन थैंक यू सो मच